it's our fundamental mentor. Um, and, and she's just really helped me, man, in so many ways. She's helped me help myself. Mm. I can, I, I will give all the credit to her. She will never take any of it because the feedback is always, you did all the work. And that is something that I think a lot of people overlook in this modern age of mentorship is the mentors want to take all the credit, but they cannot. They just, they've done the work and they are just helping people to help themselves. They can point out certain things, but all the work is done by yourself. They help people get to their own answers by asking the right questions. Mm. And you know me, I'm famous with in our group of people to always say that learn to ask the right questions. Talk less, ask more. You will learn a lot more by improving the quality of your questions. That's a good one. Yeah. It's definitely something I struggle with. <laughs> people, people are too quick to talk. Mm. People, people cannot, because everyone wants to be heard. Everyone feels like they're not being heard. So that's another thing to become content with. Like you don't always have to be heard. And that was a big one for me, wanting to be heard. And it just kind of goes back to my up, uh, upbringing. I was adopted at, uh, at birth, knew my whole entire life. Um, but unfortunately, uh, I discovered what I opened Pandora's box, basically. And that was a really hard one to go through um, on very, very deep levels. Levels of depth <laughs> that you cannot get to on your own. Mm. You, you require that you've got to work with the right people in the right setting and create context with what you working with in the now, and then you've got to recreate that context. So it, it's quite complicated. But yeah, that was a big one for, for me. And that is why I, or part of why I love being in motorsport. It was such a big ego thing. It was like, ah, oh, cool, man. Like I'm being seen, like I'm hitting it. I'm getting first place. I'm pushing, 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 pushing. It's a big ego thing to be seen, to be heard, you know? Yeah. But being seen, being heard, what value does it add to people? How does it help them? It doesn't. Yeah. Well, what I want to ask you is, and I only actually recently, recently in, and mainly since the journey in Vietnam and, and while I was traveling and working for myself, I learned to understand that having a mentor is actually very helpful and important. And I never, or I never identified having a mentor, maybe. Um, but I, I feel like I was always a kid on the loose, running around, doing whatever. But from the moment I found someone, and you're one of them, actually, that helps you and, and point things out, things are a lot clearer, of course, because that person has more experience. What I want to ask you is, for people that don't have a mentor or don't have an idea of what, what they're doing or how to find focus, how can they find a mentor in what they do or in, in life? Yeah, very good question. Very, very, very good question. How did you find a mentor? Well, I stumbled upon you. <laughs> okay, so that's one answer because sometimes that just happens, right? But there's a saying that the, the teacher teaches when the student pitches. Mm. Right? Okay. So it just means that you've got to be ready for it.